What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Got a nice video today, as usual, I hope. And uh, first off, though, want to uh, thank everybody because hit a hundred subscribers. Um, I know it's not a huge amount, but it's a pretty good milestone. And you know, I didn't. St I started this channel a while ago, but I really only started making videos probably about a month, month and a half ago, maybe two months ago at the most. So I'm really, I'm really uh, happy about that, and I think that that's a pretty good progress. And I would recommend to everybody to make these videos. I use a tool called Screencast-O-Matic. It makes it very, very, very easy to do, and I believe you can set up a free account and you and you can use it for free. But if you do, I believe they they put their watermark in it, and there's certain features that you can't use. But still. You can make decent videos with it if you want to go ahead and set up a free account. Um, you can just Google Screencast-O-Matic. I believe the actual tool is called ScreenPal. But don't quote me on that. Anyway, today is not going to be a long video, but I do want to share something valuable with you. And what I want to talk about today is... I know that I, I, I've been... Pushing, you know, kind of driving it home that the traffic exchange and safe list stuff is really great traffic. And, um, you know, I, 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 I talk a lot about why people don't get good results with it because they don't use the proper pages. So I thought today I would share with you my best funnel that I use that converts the best for me. And, and I'm going to show you a few things. And I'll show you how this funnel actually um, helps me to get referrals at different traffic exchanges. And when you get referrals, you end up, what happens is you end up getting free traffic because a lot of these traffic exchanges and viral mailers, they will give you a set amount of credits for everybody that you refer. And then as those people use the service, you usually get a percentage of what they do. For instance, if somebody that you refer goes to a traffic exchange and surfs 100 pages, you might get like 5% of that added onto your credit. So you might get like 5 uh, clicks or hits added on to your, to your credits. Now, that in and of itself is not a lot, but if you are referring a lot of people and you have a, 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 just a few people who are very active on these sites, th that can add up. Keep in mind, though that I would say 90%, and maybe it's not quite that high, let's say 80% of the people that you refer to these sites are going to do absolutely nothing with them. And that that's something that a lot of people probably wouldn't tell you. But most of the people that you refer, they're not going to use it. They may use it for a day or two or a week, and then they're just going to disregard it. Because probably they're not getting any results because they don't know what they're doing. And that that's why I want to do these trainings. I want to keep doing these trainings. I got a great compliment today from somebody who had contacted me on Facebook. And she has been watching my videos. And she said that it was such a, such a nice compliment. I, actually, she said that she likes the way that I make the videos. I don't push try to sell, you know, push sales or, or push a product, because that's not what I'm all about. I'm trying to help you guys out, and in doing so, we both benefit. This is the way that I, I learned my lesson. I used to be one of those guys who used to send promo after promo, and that's all I used to do is promote products and push products, and it just, it works up to a certain extent, and then it doesn't work anymore, and it's just cheesy. You know, what you want to do is provide value, provide good quality content, and people will follow you, and people will take your recommendations. Now, you you got to make sure that the stuff that you recommend is good. If you're recommending a bunch of crap to people, after a while, you're, you're going to end up with a bad reputation, and you're not going to have any followers, or any everybody's going to unsubscribe from your email list. Right, so you want to make sure that 
you promote good stuff and you recommend good stuff and the way that you do that is you actually have to use the stuff um, you know long gone are the days when you could just sit down and write a blog review about a product that you never that you didn't purchase or that you never use that used to work but people are wiser now and and they're safer they're more careful with their money and that's a good thing because what it does is it it makes the product vendors have to create better quality stuff so we all benefit basically when we are doing good quality honest reviews okay before i get off on a tangent about that which i think i already have let me just show you okay so this is a, a funnel that i made and this is getting big results it's simple very simple funnel okay it consists of three pages so and and two of them are are like you know it's a download page and it's a lead capture page and then i have a splash page version so right now we're on the lead capture page this is like i was saying the other day th there's two things that you want to promote on traffic exchanges and safe list, and that is ways to get traffic and things that are about making money online because that's what people are in this this is what this niche is and there's nothing wrong with that it's a good niche it's a good place to be it's very profitable it's also very competitive and that's why you like what i was saying you only have seconds to grab somebody's attention if you you know advertise something that's kind of off topic or I, I see a lot of people advertising like you know uh fat burning recipes and um you know th things to to uh clean your house with or like you know refurbish the interior of your car and stuff like that they're promoting these things and it's just not it's not going to do anything um even to promote a blog is stupid because here's the thing when you have 10 seconds, you need a page that loads very fast. And some, you know, especially like WordPress blogs, it's heavy. And, you know, it's going to take five or six seconds to load, depending on what kind of an internet connection somebody has or what kind of a computer that they have. So if you only have 10 seconds to grab somebody's attention and the site takes eight seconds to load, uh, you know, it's just, you can do the math on that one. Okay, back to this squeeze page. It's simple, a, a compelling headline. Get instant access to 18 of my most profitable traffic sources. That's true. These are the traffic, and, and this, these are the traffic sources that work for me. I've tried them all. I use them all. They're the ones that are bringing in the leads and the affiliate sales. The affiliate sales are coming from my list. I'll be honest. I don't promote sales pages on traffic exchanges because that's a waste i promote lead capture pages your, your goal here is to build your list with these things and i'll tell you these are not bad leads these leads are probably some of the best leads and you've i've heard other people other marketers say this um because these you've got someone in front of you who is looking for an opportunity they're wide open they want to start an online business they're there because they're looking to make money online they're looking for guidance and you can get be the one to give them that guidance but you have to do it right you have to uh be honest you can't sell a crappy system or um so something you know that's not going to work if you know it's not going to work and you're only trying to get a one-off commission that is a poor way to do business and you're not going to be in business very long and you're not going to do very well so we have a compelling headline i have a little sub headline and it basically explains you know these are the traffic sources that bring me leads and sales every year that's very straightforward i have a screenshot from my warrior plus account this is an actual screenshot. I don't go making um, income proofs up or taking someone else's income proof off a sales page. I, you know, I don't do that. This is an actual screenshot. And, and I tell them, enter your email. Now, this is a lead capture page. They enter the email. They're going to 
be on my list directly. I have another page, a splash page. This one doesn't have the email capture box because some traffic exchanges I've noticed uh, the forms won't load. And and if you're using, I think like get response when you if you if you if you're using an email capture when you if you're using like get response or some of the other autoresponders and you fill this out, it won't work in a frame. So if they fill this out and they click the button, uh, it won't it won't add them to your list. It goes to some sort of a weird uh, like 404 type page or something, or it tells them to click back and. It just doesn't work inside of a frame. So that's why you need to use um, these splash pages. And a splash page is the same thing as a lead capture page, except it doesn't have the email capture. It has a button here that you click, and when you click on it, then you go to the lead. You open it up in a new window. You always want to make sure that when they click on this, open it up in a new browser window because if you open it up in the same window, you're gonna you're still going to be inside the frame from the traffic exchange and it's you're not gonna it's gonna totally defeat the purpose so that's all that is so I, there's three pages that can that i made that i have to make all right and these are all done in lead leap leads leap i use leads leap for just about everything i even build lists in leads leap because they have a, a fantastic their email deliverability is really great Meaning they get emails into the inbox and hardly I, I've never seen any go to spam They do a really really good job with that uh, So I have a, a, a few smaller lists like two three hundred people in leads leap that I can email anytime and you know uh, They I don't email those lists every day But they're there if I want want you know to promote something or if I need some clicks to a video or or something like that it's great to have those leads and I provide them with a lot of good content um, down the road. So uh, that works out good. So three pages. Now the third page is the download page. And what happens is as soon as they opt in or, um, you know, as soon as they opt in from this lead capture page, I, I don't make them wait. I don't send them to sales pages or anything like that. I send them directly to the download page and this is it. And this is basically um, all of the traffic sources that I use. Now, these four here are all paid traffic co-ops. Uh, they're Warrior Plus products, so I would make a commission if anyone decides to purchase. I have those first. Then I have my six best traffic exchanges that I like to use that get me results. And my six best viral mailers. Then I have my little solo ad uh, thing for Udemy, so I can possibly make some commissions there and maybe get some free solo ad clicks. I have my two um, ad exchanges that I like, Adsly and Least Ad Space. Then I have my link for Leadsleep, because Leadsleep, in addition to being um, a page builder and, and everything else that it has, tracking links and rotator, and it's also an autoresponder. Uh, and also, it's a traffic co-op, so it has all of those things. So, um, and and it's just a great, it's just a great system. If you don't have it, you know, you you've got nothing to lose. It's free to join. Now, what I can do, I created a video some time back, and it shows you how you can take and create. I can give you share codes, and all you have to do is plug them into Leadsleep. And what's going to happen is it's going to build a page for you automatically. It's going to take about 15 seconds and it's going to be done. And all you have to do is go in and change my links for these programs to your links. I mean, you don't have to use these programs. You can put any banners in here that you want. They're just banners that the traffic exchange or viral mailers provide. These are buttons that, like I said, this page will be exact, this page will be exact, and this page will be exact. Now, I'm going to, I think I'm just going to put the share codes right in the video description. And also what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the video description to the video where I actually show you how to plug the um, 
codes into leads leap and then you can duplicate these pages so you can duplicate this whole thing uh, I, I think I'm probably crazy for giving this away because uh, this works awesome and I'm what I'm doing if I give it away is I'm gonna create other people that have and I'll create competition for myself but um, you know that's cool that's cool that'll keep me on my toes so I will put the share codes down in the description and you can use these like I said you'll have to go in and tweak a few things like you'll have to change um, these links here to your affiliate links and you'll have to change these programs out you can join each of these programs and you can just plug your link in or you can just change the banners to the programs that you belong to uh, that'd be entirely up to you um, I think that's going to be about it for today Everything will be down in the description along with that link to the video I made where I, I actually show you how to plug in the share codes. When I made that video, I was um, talking about the Mega Marketing Pro squeeze pages, which are absolutely gorgeous. That's why I joined Mega Marketing Pro, and that's also a free program. But I'll, I'll just leave a link to that video, and you can check that out. But you really don't need to worry because when you go into Leads Leap here, all you'll do is just go to page builder you'll click uh, add a new campaign when it loads so you'll click add a new campaign you'll name the campaign and then you'll it'll ask you that you'll you'll add a page in here and it'll ask you if you want to launch the uh, editor or you want to plug in a share code so all you really have to do if you ever get confused in Leads Leap is this tutorial link at the top. If you click that, there are it basically shows you how to do everything with the with the page builder. So it, it you know, and here you go right here, you could put how to import a share code, and this shows you it's got diagrams and everything. So this is very simple to do. If you're not using Leads Leap, I highly recommend a lot of most people that watch this video priority have an account there because loads of people use it because it's awesome uh but you know check it out i will put a i'll put a link to leads leap in the description as well what the heck all right that's gonna wrap up the video um go ahead and get this funnel going and i if you know it works for me it's gonna work for you so thanks so much for watching the video see you in the next one